Capricorn, welcome to your April forecast. Let's take a look what's going to be coming your way. Oh, some Capricorns will actually find out that they are pregnant this month. And or you're going to be very fertile. So if you're planning to have a baby, this is the perfect month for that. Just be very careful and proceed with caution. Okay, well, there will be a success that's going to be coming your way. And I feel like if you're also planning to have a baby, as I've said, you know, this is going to be a very perfect time for you. And you will also be positive. Now, just be careful, okay? Just um, because there will be some health complications that might develop. But you need to consult the doctor for much, um, you know, for more info, uh, for much more solid uh, findings. Now, you are also thinking about moving to a new location, buying a house, getting a new house, sell selling your house, or doing some renovations or redecorations around your, you know, around your place but i feel like you are trying to escape or you just wanted to move all together um there will also be some jealousy and tension in the family that will also be starting around the second week of this month so just be very caref careful about that and watch you know watch where you watch your move your back and what you're gonna say to them because just one little thing it will just park into something bigger they're gonna be blowing things out of proportion and of course you're just gonna get pissed off you're not really the kind of person that is confrontational or that will be getting into some verbal fights but you will just cut them off like you know like they don't exist now there is a fire sign in your life right now that you need to work on your relationship or marriage and this person um, even though this person is actually you know like you have a past life thing together but there is already a third party that's already involved. That even though you're already aware, or even though you are, you know, you ha you already have some intuition or instinct about this, you feel so stagnant or you feel so stuck in a situation that even if you want to try and deal with it, you're just too tired emotionally and mentally shut down. You're planning to travel within the within the second week of this month only to get away and to have a little breather because you're already weathering the storm alone. And nobody can understand your situation. That's why you're feeling so drained. But the good thing here is 
you need to be a little bit more careful when it comes to your finances um well there is uh, an, an sorry an unexpected money that's going to come and the projects um offers business partnerships mm. there is also another company that will also try to pirate you or to you know uh sneak you up and um make an offer to move to their company and you'll be very happy with how things are going to go but somehow be careful because somebody will be betraying you you know for some reason the third row of this cards it's all negative be very careful in moving because i feel like somebody around you is already planning to you know somebody around you is already planning to move out or planning to make some changes or to move to a new location to start a new beginning or new relationship and you will feel somehow stuck because i feel like there are some obligations that you already got compromised because of this person but despite of that you will continuously you know um, move on with your life and there will be a big transformation that is already upcoming and that you will be welcoming in your life aside from that i feel like you will also be traveling in a northern place or in the north of you and you will be cutting off this person altogether in your life okay now let's take a look at your finances uh, you want to be careful spending your money right now this month it's uh, it will be very flourishing and a prosperous month for you yet somehow you know that somebody is betraying you and someone's been stealing your work or trying to copy your work so you will be a little bit on guard and you will also be in investing in some security measures or security stuff and even though it's gonna it's gonna take some time for you to nail down who this person is you will eventually know who is the root cause of this and what are they planning to do and you'll be the winner okay uh, you will also prevent it from happening and there's also a leakage that is about to you know to happen But you will also prevent that thing now uh, Around the middle of the month Even though the first two weeks of the month Financially, it's not gonna be like uh, very satisfying for you but all throughout from uh, from the start of 15th down to the end of the month you will be very happy with the turnout of your finances let's say for example that all those dry days and dry weeks it they will you know the last two weeks of the month it will make up for all those lost revenues or lost sales or whatever it is from the first two months of the month and then you will be overflowing in the last two weeks of the month and i feel like there is somebody who is a water sign that will also try to come your way and uh there is a huge potential for the two of you to be romantic lovers finances will keep on getting stable and you will also be focusing in yourself which is good for you and you will also learn how to balance now when it comes to your love life you're already having a hard time focusing on the solution or if there is still a solution to your problem or, or to your situation it's like with all the disastrous things that's already upcoming and with all the disastrous you know um times that's been like that you've been going through you want things to end and you just want to make a brand new beginning all together and you've already learned the lesson to next time trust your instinct and never ever fail it and this person will only try to woo you just because that they want something from you and because you have a generous heart you will be giving whatever they want but trust that this person will only be taking advantage of you and right after getting what they want from you they're gonna cut you off and take off and you know the seven of swords came out so they are only after whatever they can get from you so be very careful with that and i feel like it's also time for you to cut this person off somebody from the past will also be making you happy so you need to balance now when it comes to your sex life uh, well you are looking for some sort of an excitement okay you're looking for somebody who can do you better make you feel better 
and you also miss those good old times where you were, you know, so out there acting like, you know, um, well, acting like young kids. And it seems like somebody will be will try to seduce you for Capricorn men. Somebody will try to seduce you, and they will also try to get in your way, because they really like you. And the more you, because you're very conservative, and you know you're very conventional, and that is the thing that they're gonna see to you, that will seem more challenging and uh, you know um, attractive at the same time. But unfortunately, you're not going to be very attracted to this person as you feel like you are still emotionally voided. You are trying to choose which side you'll be on. And I feel like whichever options you will, you know, whichever options you will be faced at, you don't want to keep this for now because you just want to concentrate in your new beginnings and loving yourself and besides you don't really need a sexual partner just to pleasure yourself okay so and this person will also try to you know to like um really get involved with you and this is somebody who's younger than you okay but uh i feel like this either this is a water sign or an earth sign but either way they're gonna be you know you, you will know how to put them in the right place so don't worry about it. Now when it comes to your health, be careful with what you eat. Again, be careful with some parasites, especially with the contaminated water that will be affecting you. High blood pressure, chest pain, um, sleep apnea, with a possibility of heart attack as well, or chest pain, or yeah. And you also need to be very careful with your diabetes or uh, you know sugar levels and aside from that you just need to be a little bit more careful uh, with your hmm, with the things that you, with your lifestyle more of and uh, especially if you are smoking uh, it's time for you to offer some alternative um there will be an infection in your sinus um growing cancer in your gums it's not the the, the the cancer disease it's like a you know that blister in your gums and um it's because of an infection and uh, i feel like you will also have a hard time focusing and um concentrating Now, when it comes to your oracle cards, embrace those around you. This is a time of great spiritual growth for you, making it even more important to surround yourself with those who love you and share your beliefs. Be willing to accept help from others. You could find comfort in traditional solutions, or your heart may long to try out new ideas. Healer of emotions, this is a time to follow your heart and feel the fullness of your emotions. You may feel so compelled to nurture others that you forget to care for yourself. Flashes of intuition provide you with incredible insights. You or another person is a kind, tender-hearted, loving, and trustworthy friend. Now, guardian of emotions, this situation requires emotional maturity and total trust. You're surrounded by those who have only the best of intentions, so you can rely on the advice you're given. Challenges will be resolved. This card also indicates a generous humanitarian, a refined person whom you can completely depend on. This could be a reference to these characteristics within yourself. Anyway, that's it for you for this month, Capricorn. If you want to talk to me live on the phone or live in the calls, just go and visit me at my website at sophieangel.net. Blessings to you.